I'm Geoffrey Towsey. I've just finished my third year at Essex doing a BA Contemporary History. I arrived on a visit day here and seeing the campus and the way the campus was was a big draw for me but equally there's also the element of the modules that are on offer here at Essex. Now that I've finished my third year here I've decided to stay on for another year and do my MA so I'll be studying for my MA in History. The reason why I decided to do an MA was I've enjoyed my time so much here that I've decided to carry on with an extra little bit of research. I work as a student ambassador for both the department and the university. They're in two main forms. One is when you've got visitors coming to the university, prospective students, parents, carers as well. It's just guiding them around the university, guiding them around the department, showing them what's here. But as well as that, student ambassador role also involves working with lots of school groups and that can be through from sort of year sixes through to sort of sixth form college, so year 13. And again, working with them on a range of different things, telling them about sort of the joys of university, further education and higher education as well. So there's a real mix of things as a student ambassador. In my first year, I was just a member of the History Societies. My second year, I was part of the exec as events officer. And in my third year, and again for my master's year, I'm going to be president of the society, so sort of generally running the society and we try to run a range of different events as well as volunteering projects that we run. We also will do talks, we will do social events, it's a really good thing to get involved with and even though it's obviously history related it sort of gets your mind off the studies at times which is good. One of our most successful events that we've run is our careers events which has got a good turnout and I think that's good because it's the mix between sort of an event, there's the opportunity for sort of the social side, getting to meet new people, but equally it's the skills you're going to gain, sort of the insight that students can gain about sort of jobs that are open to students with a history degree. So with the careers events we've had former history students from Essex who have come in and given talks, they've been sort of mainly for this year been members within the university, so not necessarily academics, but people who've worked in human resources, marketing, sort of admin. But next year we're also hoping to open it up and get a range of uh, alumni from outside of the university as well, so the mix. And as well as that sort of general ideas of helping building CVs and sort of doing general careers workshops as well. I think obviously by being involved with all sort of the extracurricular activity things alongside the study you're going to gain the transferable skills. It seems like a cliche, but obviously things like the communication skills because you're dealing with the students, you're communicating with the students. Also, I suppose, an element of, sort of project management skills because you're sort of given a brief, then got to go away and make it happen. My advice as regards for voluntary work is 100% definitely get involved with as much as you possibly can, and especially here at the University of Essex and offer a range of different projects. So there's no excuse to not get involved with something. Three words for, if I could summarise uh, history at Essex, would be, I suppose, research, because research intensive university, and that's very research focused department. I would also say community, because the community nature of the department, the friendly nature of students and staff as well. And thirdly, I suppose I'd say opportunities, the opportunities you're given throughout the university as a whole, as well as the department.